Okay, what is up guys? So we're back with another video. Before we get started, go down there, like, subscribe, or new to fish bell. Let's get to it. So today I'm going to show you guys uh my fish tub. The other video that's on my YouTube channel, my fish tub, is from I believe May 13th. But now we're up at the fish tub. And then you can see all the fish. And then I'm gonna point out all the ones I have names for. The biggest guy I have right there, he's about 8 inches, his name's Beast Turd, and then Penelope, and then Rico, he's half white, he's smaller, right there's Rico, and then there's Jamarcus, right there, right there's Jamarcus, he has, his belly's white, but I've currently ran out of food fish food and I don't have time to go to the pet store or anything and get some so I'm just going to use what I paint my fish traps to catch the fish in the first place which is bread so let's get this bread open okay we got a full slice of bread here, so let's just rip it up and toss it in. Here's Jamarcus. They're tearing it up. That's a koi fish. Marcus. They're killing it. But if you don't know already, these fish are comet goldfish. It's just a type of goldfish. They can grow anywhere, they live up to 40 years and they can grow anywhere from under 1 inch to 24 inches, which would be 2 feet. Let's go down to the pond and check the fish traps. Okay guys, now we're walking up to the pond right now. I got two tube fish traps. Um... I don't think there's going to be anything in it because Dixie's in the water. Dixie, come on. Get out of the water. Dixie's in the water and I haven't baited them for a week. Well, not a week. Four days. Almost a week. Just set the GoPro down and pull up the trap. There's a bunch of reeds in the way so it's, it's hard to pull them up. Usually every time I sit it, I catch a tadpole. Uh-oh, I got the trap hooked on something. There we go. Yeah, I think we caught a tadpole. Yep, caught another tadpole. Little tadpole guy. Just toss him back. Set the trap down. Let's go check the other trap. Let's do right next to each other. Because this is the place I catch the most fish. I've done experiments and stuff. And tested around to see where I catch the most fish at. And right here is where I catch the most, most fish at. There is channel cats in here. Just a couple of them. Uh, reproduce. There's definitely a tadpole or fish or something in this trap, I think. Might just be weeds. Yeah, I think it's weeds. This trap I've had to do a lot of repairs to because a snap internal got inside of it. And so did a crowd down and it was torn up. So there's nothing in this trap, I believe. So let's toss this trap in the yard and we bait him. 
I'm just using plain white bread that I got at the store at Dollar General. Just rip this bread in half and put it inside the trap. Sit on the ground, grab two more pieces of bread. Just go bake the other trap. Okay, we'll set the traps now. There's my bucket I used to transport the fish. If I have fish, I, I decide to fit in my tub. And then let's get a piece of bread just as a lure or a bait to attract the fish to the traps. So there's one trap right there. There's another trap right there. There's, I can already see there's some fish around them. Just toss half somewhere near the traps. If you look really hard, you can see orange and black spots. I wonder if there's any frogs over here right now, because I know there are usually all these frogs over here. Nope, there's no frogs right now. I wonder if there's one right here. How did that get in the pond? I don't know. I got a great. Oh, there's a bag in. Okay. Climb down in the pond and get the stuff out of the pond. I'm just gonna set the GoPro like right here so I can climb down. Because there are swap mats here, and there's like there's two rows of them, like there's two sections of them, so it's kind of like a ladder. Dixie, you get out of my face, you're gonna make me fall. Okay, that rock I think's fine. There's more trash right there. Wonder if there's any tadpoles or anything. The water seems really dirty today. I think it's just because of the humidity and the hot of the salt. Yep, there's tadpoles. Oh, yep, there's a dead fry right there. That sucks. Probably got too hot for him. Wonder if there's any tadpoles or anything in this. Or any crawdads, or probably a crawdad in here. Nope, nothing. Oh, there is a tadpole in here. Get this up. Yeah, but usually there's frogs all over these reeds right here. Look at all the itty bitty fry that are attacking that piece of bread right there. There's some of that there too. Oh, this climb back up this. Just moving your socket. Move around. It's kind of harder to get back up this than it is to get down it. <laughs> down there before. Let's go back on the dock. See, look right there. All the fish are swimming around at that bread. There's a fish sticking out of the water right there too. See the orange and stuff. And look, oh, look at how my traps like exploded with orange. It's a big
big guy to fish with. But I know once if my channel ever explodes, which it probably won't, um, people are gonna ask me if I'm selling the comic goldfish. I am selling them as bait fish or pet fish. Yes, people use goldfish as catfish bait or bass bait. If if you live out in the country like I do, you'll know that people use goldfish as bait. I'm just gonna set you guys down. Would you guys just look at the pond for a couple of minutes? Yeah, but let's just sit here. I'll just sit here and see you guys when I go to pull the trap out of the water. Okay, guys, uh, we're going to have to pull up the traps a couple minutes early because I have to go get ready because I'm going to go to my pawpaws and work at his house. I love my pawpaws. He's a really nice, sweet man. He's a hard worker man, too. So, yeah, let's go ahead and pull up these traps. I'm trying to be careful so I don't tear the traps when I pull them up. So I'm going to sit you guys down. And then you guys can watch me pull up the trap. And if there's... You know what? Let's go get water first. So that way if there's any goldfish that I'm keeping, I can take them up to my tub. Because I don't like to keep the small guys. Because if I keep the small guys in the pond, they'll have more room to grow bigger. And then I can catch them later in time when they're bigger. Goldfish only grow an average of two inches a year. So, yeah. Oh, see all the fry that are swimming around? Around all these fish eggs? Yeah, I gotta be very careful when I'm getting water because I don't want to kill any of the fish eggs because it'll that'll start to stress out other fish when they realize that their eggs have been killed and they won't lay any more eggs until they know it's safe. And a lot of people think I'm just making this stuff up. No, I've done a lot of research on goldfish. <laughs> a lot. Okay, we're back with the water. Let's pull up the traps. These are only been in here for like 20 minutes, so would not surprise me if there's nothing in both these traps. Nothing in this trap. That's that means there's probably nothing in the other trap. But we'll still check the other trap. That did not go out where I wanted it to. I got caught in the rake hoe. I'll just let it sit in the water till I reset it again. Okay, let's bring the bucket with us just in case there is a fish that I decide to keep in this trap, which I don't know if there is any fish in this trap at all. It's kind of a good game of guess who every time you set the trap. There's a bunch of tiny fish, but the holes are too big in my fish traps for the tiny fish to be able to be caught. See any fish? I don't see any fish. Seriously? Oh no, I see one fish. I think it's a fish. Nope. Oh yeah, I did catch a fish. Okay, I caught two tackles on a fish. It's a really small guy. He's definitely not a keeper. That sucks. I really wanted to catch some fish so I could show you guys, but... Sometimes when you're in a rush, you don't get what you want. See that little small goldfish? I say he's about an inch or two long. It's got a nice golden color on him though. So I'm back. Pour out of water. Set our bucket underneath the porch. Okay guys, if you guys liked this video, please go down there, like, subscribe, ring the notification bell, and I'll see you all next time. Peace.